Now let's check in with CBS News hurricane consultant David Bernard. He's chief meteorologist at our Miami station WFOR. David, good morning. What's the latest? Well, good morning, Rebecca. We have a strengthening tropical, tropical storm Lee this morning. Uh, the winds are 50 miles per hour, but as Begat was talking, it's all about the rain and the slow movement. Right now, that position 95 miles south of Lafayette, Louisiana, moving north at 7. And here's the problem. As we go through today, tomorrow, and into Labor Day, look how slow the storm moves. It's not until Tuesday that it gets into Mississippi and Alabama, and that just means this heavy rain is going to continue. This is the latest satellite and radar fix this morning. And uh, here's New Orleans, and we just continue to see these feeders of strong tropical bands moving from southeast to northwest across all of south Louisiana into Mississippi, Alabama, and even the Florida panhandle. So how much rain? Well, you heard in Begat's piece, we could see extreme cases of up to 20 inches where you see the red and the purples on that map, basically all of South Louisiana, South Mississippi, and as far east as places like Mobile, Alabama, we could be talking easily 8 to 12 inches. And in some cases, we could be talking better than a foot of rain. So I really think the big story with Lee is going to be the flooding potential from rain. And then we're going to have to watch the storm tide as it moves off to the east. We could see some rather high levels on Lake Pontchartrain and also in some of the bayou areas south of New Orleans. David Bernard, thanks. We'll be checking back in with you later in the program for the latest.